What's going on YouTube? Good here again with JH Hunter Plus. Back with our next SK's video for you guys today. I've made quite a few SK's video before, but one I never make before is whether a Chinese SK's or Russian SK's, which one is the better rifle. Here with me today guys, I take out my Chinese SKs. I don't have my Russian SKs to show you guys side by side but I'm gonna just talk just a little bit of you know my knowledge you know because I shoot both rifle before and very fun they work pretty much the same way as you guys see it's, it's all empty the Russian SKs, it's more nicer, more cleaner than the Chinese SKs. And I hear people say that the Chinese SKs, it's more accurate than the Russian SKs. And they say the, Rus the Russian SKs, it's going to last longer than the Chinese SKs. I don't know how true that is because the boat rifle are very fun rifle to shoot and the ammunition for it it's pretty decent. You can get them and have a blast. But when I shoot the Russian SKs, it feel a little bit more comfortable because if you look on the stock for the Russian SKs it's it feel to me it's a bit more bulkier than the Chinese SKs so it give you like a more better grip than the Chinese SKs and if you're looking for like collectible SKs lots of people more go towards the Russian SKs because they look so much cleaner and stuff like that right there this is my first rifle I purchased when I picked up my firearm license and this is a straight keeper for me i've owned lots of russian skis and i've sold them trade them you know to get more firearms so i could just keep making videos but i'm going i'm going to definitely pick myself up back a next russian one and try to hold on to it from deer on but if if you're gonna look if if you look online you always see the chinese escape chinese sks is way cheaper than the russian sks and nowadays i would look online and you don't even see much chinese sks online for sale I hear someone say that they make more Chinese SKs than Russian SKs. But when you look around, you know, I would think it's the opposite way. Because Russian SKs, they are all over the place. And very fun rifle to shoot. And the Chinese SKs, they come with the spike bayonet and russian S sks they come with the blade bayonet but you also have some chinese sks that also come with the blade bayonet so sometimes you will see a chinese sks with the blade bayonet and lots of people will mistake it for a russian sks but as soon as you pick it up and start to 
inspect it, then you will know the difference right there. The, the Russian one, normally you will always see a star right on the right up here. So that could give you a really quick idea on what kind of SKS is that. But if I have to pick, you know, one SKS to say this one is the better one, it's going to be tough, but the Russian SKS, it's more cleaner and I shoot it, I shoot the both of them and there's a slight little difference when you shoot the Russian SKS. It's, it's a little bit more nicer to shoot, but you really have to, you really have to, you know, shoot and just feel them out for yourself to feel that difference. But the boat rifle, they work pretty much the same way. So if you want a rifle just to, a his case just to go and do some shooting and you're not looking for more like collectible stuff, the Chinese one, you pick it up, you're gonna have the same fun you have with the Russian his case. But if you're looking for like more cleaner and collectible wise then russian is case that's where people more lean towards this is my like i said this is my first is case first rifle and this ain't going nowhere lots come after hit and they're gone leave it and you look right here in standard this case you got your little cleaning cleaning kit right there so that's if you look at this it's not nice and clean anyway it's nice and clean standard little this case i'm not gonna even bother to pull it apart because i've done this case video already where i pull it apart and show you guys how to clean it up and stuff like that one of these day i'm going to buy like a a topco stock and show you guys how to take your sks from the wood stock to your topco stock something to look a little bit more you know classy like your AR-15 style, you know, give it a look like that, but just subscribe and leave me a comment and hit that thumbs up button and lots more nice video coming in the future, so that's all I got for you guys today, so peace.